Hello ladies and gentlemen, Holotide here, and this weekend is the first LAN event for HCS. It's actually kind of crazy to think about because we haven't seen the Bandit starts on LAN since the Bandit came out for Ranked, and that feels like it was literally forever ago. So that's kind of weird. But if you watch the HCS, go ahead and let me know in the comments down below who you think is going to win. My money is on Space Station. We'll see what happens. But what I really want to talk about is the potential of new content coming to Halo Infinite next reset. Now, it always seems like there's always some type of trailer or announcement at these events. I think there's so many eyes on Halo during HCS events anyways that they're just like, yeah, let's just throw something out there and get people hyped. Maybe more people will come back to the game. And I don't think that this weekend is gonna be any different. Now, this is where we're kind of going to venture down into some spoilery, leaky, rumory stuff. So everything is with a grain of salt, as always. I do trust the people who are talking about this stuff, and even if it doesn't come out Tuesday, it seems like eventually this content gets into the game at some point. That being said, if you enjoy Halo and Halo content, go ahead and sub to the channel. I know 90% of you aren't subbed and watch the videos, and I feel like a lot of people tell me that they didn't even realize they're not subbed. They just see it on like the like homepage of YouTube. So it would make a massive difference to me and really help me out. So if you don't follow these accounts on Twitter, Delta underscore AE and Technical Halo, these guys have been basically leaking stuff since the start of Infinite. But it looks like... Next reset, there are going to be seven new maps for the squad battle playlist, which would be absolutely insane, honestly. That's that's a ton of new maps. But the squad battle playlist is one of my favorite. It, it has been kind of stale because we haven't gotten new maps since the release. You know, BTB has had a little bit of a refresh with new maps being added. Dev and Forge. But it seems like they're going to repurpose some of the maps as well that were already in the game. That being Behemoth, Forbidden, Launch Site, and Tempest. Now I've also heard some rumblings that 343 definitely wants to bring in the classic Halo games maps into Infinite. And I think we're going to see that more and more as the future goes on. We've already talked about, speculated that Halo Infinite might be getting sunset, that they're working on other things. And I feel like this is that middle ground to keep content coming to Halo Infinite so it doesn't just die outright and keeps people engaged with Halo. Now, I'm not going to show pictures or anything of these maps or, you know, screenshots or anything like that. You can go check them out on Twitter if you want to. But as always, I'm super excited whenever we get new content to the game, especially when it's not like cosmetics. So yeah, I'm happy if this happens on Tuesday, but I think eventually, no matter what, it's going to come out. But let me know in the comments down below how you feel if the squad battle playlist is your favorite, least favorite, you know, let me know. I read every single comment. If you don't want to leave a comment about that stuff, but you made it this far in the video, go ahead and put Poopy Tide in the comments down below, and people are going to be, like, super confused, and they're going to be like, oh my god, all these people hate Hollow Tide, he's poopy. But that's going to do it for the video. If you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like down below. It definitely helps out the channel and that YouTube algorithm. Things are hard out here for the Halo YouTubers, let me tell you. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, and I'll catch you around the ring.